On Thursday, May 12, in the Italian city of Turin, was held the second semi-final of the Eurovision Song Contest 2022. The top 10 competitors from 18 participating countries were qualified for the finals. They will perform again on May 14. It should be noted that, according to Bookmaker's forecasts, participants from Cyprus and San Marino should have got to the finals. But Eurofans decided that Azerbaijan and Romania should perform in the finals this year. Belgium, Jeremy Makis, Czech Republic, We Are Domi, Azerbaijan, Nadir Rustamli, Poland, Ochman, Finland, The Rasmus, Estonia, Stefan, Australia, Sheldon Riley, Sweden, Cornelia Jacobs, Romania, WRS, and Serbia, Constracta, advanced to the final. Bookmakers also switched the order of the winning countries. Previously, Italy, 16%, and Sweden, 11%, were predicted to second and third place. However, after the semi-finals, Italy moved down to fourth place, 6%, England came second, 11%, and the chances of Sweden in the third place just slightly dropped, 9%. At the same time, the percentage gap between Ukraine and the likely silver medalist has become even larger. Previously, it was 25%, but now, with an estimated 60% probability of victory for Kalush Orchestra, the gap is 49%. Last year, the group Manskin, who released a new track on the eve of the final of Eurovision 2022, the probability of victory was estimated at 22% in their main competitor, the French, at 19%. The average coefficient for the winner each year is about 3.25 to 3.5, this year's coefficient for Kalush Orchestra is less than 1.5. Therefore, such a high probability prediction for the winner, as made by the bookmakers this year, can be considered unprecedented. 66th Eurovision Song Contest 2022 is taking place in the Italian city of Turin at the Pala Olimpico Arena. Semi-finals will be held on May 10 and 12, while the grand final on May 14. 40 countries will be represented in the contest, with Armenia, which did not participate in the contest in 2021, and Montenegro, which missed two contests, returning to the competition. At the same time, Belarus, disqualified last year, as well as Russia, which was not allowed to participate in the contest for its invasion of Ukraine, will not be able to participate in Eurovision 2022. In the final, the winners of the semi-finals will also be joined by the representatives of the founding countries of the competition, the UK, Italy, Spain, France, and Germany. Thus, in the final of Eurovision 2022, we will see representatives of 24 countries. By the way, Italy would have been in the finals anyway, because Rockers Manskin won Eurovision 2021 and brought the song contest to Turin.